Run Mystery and Queen. Seven your side piecing together the trail of damage after a driver slammed into parked cars. Along with surveillance video, there was only one real clue left behind at the scene. Nina Pineda put on her detective cap to solve this one. Nina? Well, the trail was pretty cold, but the victims were still paying for all this damage. More than 20 grand in smash glass and mash metal. We had just this one clue. We got on the case of this hit and run driver. He guns it. Joe Sorello estimates the driver of this car is probably going over 20 in reverse. Watches the car going backwards. Manages to hit two cars each on opposite sides of the street. His neighbors woke up to a mess. Their cars mauled by the crazy 3 a.m. loop-de-loop. Very violently and then drives off. Three cameras caught almost every angle, including the driver walking around before beginning his ring of wreckage, but leaving something behind. This is their side mirror. You see it getting knocked off in the video, and that's not all he saw. The green Toyota missing the side mirror, scraped up on the side going by. But no one caught the license plate number, sticking the victims with thousands in insurance deductibles. So we started looking for the Camry. I am trying to locate the owner of this vehicle. It was towed here on November 11th. But the manager at Mola Auto Repair was mom. I just need the license plate number and the phone number. It's going to be much easier to deal with me than the police. Maybe he didn't want to say anything because after we tracked down the license plate number ourselves, we found out the car in the video is owned by Mola Auto Repair. The owner of this car hit four other cars. We got an earful from the owner's daughter. Some crazy employees, I'm sorry. She admitted the crash Camry was her dad. He owns a car repair. Car repair, yeah. okay, so it's one of, this is one of his cars? Yeah, he's in his office right now. But when we went back, her dad had ducked out. We were here last week asking yeah. questions about the Camry. Yeah, yeah. And everyone pretended they didn't know what was going on. Later, we got the owner on the phone. He gave me his insurance, insurance. information, plus said he would cover all the damaged cars deductibles. You've got a lot of tenacity. We all thought there was no hope. Everyone gave up. I just want to say thank you to Seven on Your Side. You've done everything. We would be nowhere. Oh, Nina. <laughs> okay, so the owner of this car, the side mirror, was once attached to, said the employee driving that car uh -huh. didn't tell him he had four parked cars. Instead, he told his boss he was the victim of a hit and run. And then he filed a police report <gasps> saying that he was the victim of the hit and run. Regardless, oh, no. the owner of this car said that if the insurance doesn't pay, he will pay out of pocket. Well, if not, wow. I know you're going to be right after him again. <laughs> oh, yeah. Way to go, Nina. Tracking them down. Nina. <laughs> Thanks. So good. Thanks.